Hey, welcome back to our channel, Double Decker Family. Uh, today, we are gonna do a little bit of an experiment. A few weeks ago, I purchased a toy Double Decker bus, and, and then I purchased some car wrap, and just wrapped the, the toy Double Decker bus. The problem was that this uh, Double Decker is not the one that is that, that will be in, and that we're building for our journey. And so I went online and I started looking for our bus. We have a Van Hool TD925 or the newer versions of the TDX. And unfortunately, these toys are nearly impossible to find. But I was able to contact the dealership and they had some as marketing materials I was able to get from them. They were very friendly and uh, allowed me to get a few of these from them. So. What I'm gonna go ahead and do, what we're gonna do today, is we've got five colors and five buses, and we are gonna uh, wrap each of these buses in a different color. We're trying to, we're trying to figure out what paint color uh, to use for our bus. Um, we like this camo, the way that the camo came out on this bus. So we're not gonna do the camo on any of these, but we also have one here called Nardo Gray. That's a darker gray color. We have a brushed uh, brushed steel one, a brushed stainless steel. I kind of like that one. We'll see how that turns out. We have this one that's glow in the dark. Uh, I don't know that we would ever do an entire bus in the glow in the dark, but we'll, we may use it for some trim actually. We're gonna try one of these whole buses in it. And then we have these two. These are, are fairly similar. This is ice gray matte or flat. And this is ice gray. Uh, gloss. So we're going to try each of the buses in these colors. Go ahead and uh, drop in the comments below. Tell us what color that you think we should try on our bus. Uh, maybe I'll order some more of the sample size um, sample size vinyl wrap and maybe we'll, we'll try wrapping these again with some suggestions from you guys. So be sure to drop, uh, drop your favorite color or whatever color you think we should try on the bus. Drop that in the comments below. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and share. Uh, the rest of this video, I think we're going to probably speed it up because this can, can take a little bit of time here. So uh, hopefully you enjoy the, the finished product when we're done, but uh, we'll get to that point in just a moment.
All right, so I got five of these buses done. I didn't do the last one because the color is really the same. It's just a matter of gloss versus flat uh, as this one. So I went ahead and, and didn't do the last one there. Um, you probably noticed the kids got bored pretty quickly. Uh, not as good as an activity for them as I had hoped, but um, but really the, the whole point of this was for me to be able to see the different colors as we choose a color for our bus. Uh, so I have ice gray, that's this one here. Uh, the ice gray is, I mean, it's it's really just kind of like an off-white. It's, it's pretty close to like an eggshell uh, color. Not sure if I like, I thought I would like that one the best. And I'm really just not sh sure how well I like it. I have this glow in the dark. Um, and when it glows in the dark, it's green. It's middle of the day right now and it's pretty bright in this room. So there's really no way I can show you the glow, glow in the dark. But it's a green glow in the dark. That's more of a novelty than anything. Um, I don't think we're actually going to wrap our entire bus in a glow in the dark um, <laughs> wrap. Uh, could be neat. The kids have said that they want to use the glow in the dark on some of the trim in the bus. And we actually have thought about using it uh, on the interior of the bus as as far as like floor guides and stuff at night to help the kids to uh, to get to the, the bathroom and whatnot. Use that without waking everybody up. We then have what's the, what's called Nardo Gray. This is a fairly dark gray. Uh, it's, it's a flat and it's a pretty common color on a lot of cars right now uh, for doing wraps. And I, I do like it. Um, I feel like it's maybe a little bit too dark still, but uh, you know, you, you tell me. Leave uh, leave some comments um, down below. Let me know what you think about each of these colors. This one again is the Nardo gray. Um, we then have this one here, and I actually really like this. Um, I don't know how practical it would be on the bus, but this is a um, this is like a, a brushed silver. Um, it is texturized kind of, which for the purposes of this was a little bit difficult, uh, but I like the coloring of it. Uh, so I, I like that one as far as color goes quite a bit. And then uh, the camo, and this one's got um, a few different shades of grays and blacks and whites in there. I do like it. I think the gray, particular on, on this one particular, uh, maybe a little bit too dark. Um, we wanna keep the bus fairly light colored in order to keep keep it cool and um, we don't want to we don't want the, the bus heating up too much uh, but I do like the camo pattern a lot and um, it's probably probably my kids favorite as well so we have the camo we have glow in the dark we have ice gray nardo gray and brushed silver uh, so those are each of the colors that uh, that I wrapped these buses in. A few things that I did learn. A, I should never wrap anything professionally. I'm terrible at this. I definitely have the wrong tools to be doing this. Uh, but it is easy enough to do, and, and for the purposes of just trying to figure out what colors we like for our bus, it worked out just fine. Um, it is. A, I, I think it is fun. Maybe not as fun for the kids that are as young as mine. And uh, I didn't really want to mess them with the knife too much. Uh, the the hot air got a little bit too hot, that kind of thing. But overall, um, I think it was a, a, a fun experience to try to do this. Um, I would encourage anybody to do this. If you're, if you're trying to think of your paint colors for your bus or um, if you're building a schoolie or something, this might be a, a good activity for you to do. Uh, go ahead and drop your comments down below. Tell me what color you like. Maybe there's a color I didn't think of, um, a wrap that I should, uh, I should order and do on this last one here. Um, but drop your comments below, like, share, subscribe. We appreciate your time. Take care.